A viewer used our share for button on KOB.com to send us a shocking video of what appears to be serious negligence. Caleb James invited APD to take a closer look, and Caleb, the officer you spoke to says he's seen judges throw the book at people for this. Yeah, that's right, and even as painfully slow as we played it for you just there, it's still hard to see until you see it. Did you catch that? How about now? We put this video and even a still shot on our Facebook page this evening. Nearly a hundred guesses later, only a few people saw what the viewer who sent us this clip says he saw. There's a baby driving, says one of our Facebook fans. Well, not driving, but the man who shot this video says he followed that reckless driver with a baby standing on her lap for several minutes before he caught this quick clip of her swerving around a corner. Now this parent probably get a gold medal for worst parent of the year. APD officer Simon Drobik saw it right away. And my experience in 17 years with child restraint laws, when it gets in front of a judge, they throw the book at you. Drobik says if this driver had been pulled over by a sharp-eyed APD officer, she would have been cited with a misdemeanor. But if the child had been hurt, it turns into a felony charge. In 17 years, I've never taken a dead child out of a child restraint, but I have witnessed dead children through windshields because they weren't wearing a child restraint. And to that tipster who clicked our share four button with this video, Drobik says it genuinely helps. Unless there was an officer at the corner witnessing it, it would happen outside of our presence. Uh, yes, it was a good thing that they brought it to our attention. Uh, at least we can get the word out that this type of behavior, zero tolerance in this type of behavior. And Jobik says if that driver had been pulled over by police, it would have been an automatic referral to CYFD. Like he said, no tolerance. APD is working to identify the driver of this vehicle through a license plate number. Back to you, Tessa. Okay.